Dan. Yes, Marvin. Why am I here? Why are we on this screen and not in Animal Crossing? Well, you're here on a weekday evening uh, because I have an exciting development that I had to pause midway through because I realized, oh shit, I don't have this. I, like This needs to be committed to memory. Uh -huh, um, uh -huh. uh, and I think I alluded to this you know, uh, a little bit in the last installment. Um, the point, uh, or Tom Nook's plan for the island, for Thrillho, was mm -hmm. to get the island in such a good shape that it was attractive to visitors, prominent visitors, high-profile visitors, such as one K.K. Slider, the guitar yeah, he playing wanted his dog. Own, he wanted his own personal Tom Nook Fire Festival. Exactly. And for that reason, um, I, or... Uh, with that as a, with that goal in mind, I diligently worked away at it, started decorating things, installing new stuff, paying for mm -hmm. public works since getting <laughs> bridges bridges built, inclines built. I, I like the idea that 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 a famous superstar won't come unless the place looks pretty and has bridges. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> nah. Beyonce will not attend your country. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't Your have sovereign enough island nicely nation? developed cities in it. <laughs> Which, in a very, very broad way, uh, manner, is actually true. <laughs> <laughs> I need, mean, that's exactly why Fire, why Fire Fest <laughs> failed, right? Because <laughs> it was not developed. <laughs> yeah, you need a venue. If Fire Fest had bridges... And fruit trees planted everywhere. No, man, you need infrastructure. And honestly, the <laughs> island had none. So I was busy building it. And here we are. We're, we're, we're in there. Okay. Um, and actually, yesterday, last night, uh, Isabel told me that my island was three stars. And, oh. and they survey people. She gives you like uh, pe uh, survey uh, blurbs from like random people who you may recognize, you might not. But then mm -hmm. um, she read off like, hey, I might actually want to visit there someday. Signed, KS. <sighs> and KS, uh, like that perked up Tom Nook's ears. Like, KS, that's fucking KK Slider. That must mean he Hell actually yeah. wants to visit. So I'm going to call him on my cell phone because I have his number. <laughs> Why didn't you just ask him before? <laughs> he was too. He was too shy. He knew that Thruho wasn't in con in in good shape yet. This he is the most to, roundabout way to ask him on a date. He needed like. to strike when the time was right. Uh, so over the phone, he got him to agree to come, and uh, he arrived at my island. Um, uh -huh. I began the conversation sometime when the sun was still out, and okay. Um, so there might be a very sudden, drastic change in lighting when I when I load this up. Let's get in there. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Yes. Oh, it's him! Hey, it's KK, and he's always uh, listed as KK only, not Slider. They don't put Slider in his like little he's too label. Cool. You don't say the say the full name, man. Yeah. So hey, Thrillho, it's real groovy being here today. That's the first thing he said. I stopped there. Feels like this dream I once had when I was just a scruffy pup with a shoebox guitar. I was dreaming of hitting out on my own, wandering wherever my road would take me. Yep. KK really is a drifter type. We cannot stop swaying. <laughs> We're so hyped. <laughs> we we have the rhythm already. He doesn't need to do a thing. <laughs> During a fighting magical place where cool cats like you would come together to see a stray like me. Oh, referring to himself as a stray. You're you're better than a stray, KK. Oh, yeah. He's, he's got a very Johnny Cash vibe right now. Yeah. Sorry <laughs> about that. I am a coyote. <laughs> I do run on. Time to get your that. fingers snapping. <laughs> I love that when Johnny Cash spoke about his cameo in The Simpsons, he's like, that's how you do a cameo. Make me a weird coyote. <laughs> <laughs> well, they got him to gnaw on a, on a leg or sound like he yeah. was, and it's like, yeah. good. Get Johnny Cash to do that. That's something no one else can get Johnny Cash to do. <laughs> Amazing. We're gonna snap our fingers. We owe we owe Simpsons a great debt to getting that committed on like a recording. Many uh, things. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. Time to get your finger snapping, like you said. Right on. This one goes out to all you cool cats on Thrill Ho. I you call made a it new song. <gasps> Fade to black. Oh wow! <laughs> this is neat. 
Oh, it's the song. Oh, it's credits! <laughs> you have defeated Animal Crossing. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank you for taking this ride with us. <laughs> Through Animal Crossing, I beat Animal Crossing New Horizons, everyone. It's over. <laughs> Actually, this is typical. Um, KK Slider, whenever you have him uh, play his guitar on like a Saturday when he's acoustic, uh -huh. um, he the the credits play over whatever you whatever you requested. Uh, okay, you got those 3D glasses on, dang. Yeah, I could easily be a henchman for Biff. <laughs> you are the most valuable player. Yes. Yeah, you may have noticed that there are several more animals listening to him than previously occupied my island in the last installment. Um, the new additions here are Elise the monkey. She is a snooty type. Apple the hamster. She's a peppy type like Cookie. Um, peppy Cookie. I have... I don't know if Del was around yet. This that alligator there? No, I didn't remember him. I don't remember He's him. a cranky type. And, um... Genji, that like white colored black eared bunny, mm -hmm. is a Japanese centric jock. Somewhat like, <laughs> like he loves talking about exercising, but his whole aesthetic is nothing but traditional Japanese stuff. Okay. And I, I thought you were going to say he's Japanese type. <laughs> I, I, I would call, like, you're tempted to call him a weeb, but he might just be <laughs> Japanese actually, so you don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I guess those are... Uh, is very happy. Oh, and then also Eunice, the, the little sheep over there. She's another normal type like Bertha. And the normal types tend to be the, um, the nicest. Because they act polite like a normal person would, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, see that was real know. nice, KK Slider. Thanks Thank for doing you. that. One song set. I mean, it is a free concert, you know. True. I've been to a couple of free concerts. Uh, this one time, Puffy Ami Yumi was at Amoeba Records in LA. Ah. And I, that was like the first time I ever saw, um, like a, a live rock band. <laughs> uh, but I already knew who they were. We were there right, right, for right. them, but they only played like three songs and then effed off. And then luckily they did a real show at the Roxy later on and I attended that. Oh, nice, nice. A real show. Yeah. Puffy Amiumi is a good act to, to see and see live. I recommend it if you ever get the chance, but they don't tour anymore because they all yeah, got I don't think kids. they'll ever come back to America. <laughs> yeah, I think they are done with trying to um, yeah. infiltrate. The pillows the might never come back either. This might have been their last tour. <sighs> yeah, FLCL 2 and 3 did not fare that well. Yeah, but I'm so we glad we got to see them. Man. Yeah, that was a really, like, I, I was so glad that we were able to get in there for that one, for that time. The, the best part was when we were, we were like, uh, the, the concert ended and people started leaving and we were like, they're idiots. They're yeah, definitely you, doing you, you, you a, an encore. So like, we took up the spots in front of them even closer and they came back and they played my favorite song, Last Dinosaur. <laughs> oh yeah, Last Dinosaur is a classic encore for them in America. And like, I don't understand who the hell goes to that concert and doesn't even wait to see. The house lights encore. weren't even on. Like, I know, did you like everything about it was like, you. Oh gosh. Maybe, <laughs> maybe they weren't even fans. No, no, there's a the bunch of noobs. Weeby noobs. Idiots. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> wait, we're playing Animal Crossing? Yes, Animal yeah. Crossing. Tom Nook, did you enjoy KK's concert? I did. I always enjoy KK's music, Tom Nook. I'm a bigger fan than you, maybe. Yeah, you fucking... Secondary. Nah, he could probably out. He could probably out trivia me. No, no, no. Tom Nook actually created an entire island <laughs> and habitation program just to get him to play one concert. <laughs> yeah, so. I think I think I I think t uh, KK Slider can play ninety three songs in this game. I think I counting. That's a repertoire. Yeah, he's got a he's got a extensive discography, and every single one of them has an album cover. Yeah, that's the best part. That yeah, they, I love, they, they bother I to make like a unique album, album cover. And I love that they're consistent too. They don't redesign them just because it's a new game. It's like if that's the cover it had, then that's its cover, goddammit. Dang, it's good. It's 
Yeah, that's why some older covers like have like really low res, awful looking villagers on it. <laughs> but it's great. No, that's the style. That was the style at the time. Yes, exactly. Villagers were polygonal. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna give me a song. The Welcome oh, Horizon nice. song. A song that apparently everyone was had anxiety hearing when they were looking hear, hearing it in the trailers. <laughs> Well, I don't know about anxiety, but people definitely got sick of hearing it because they would not <laughs> stop playing that one version of it over and over again. Yeah. Um, but it, like you know, it's Nintendo, so there's heavy late motif everywhere. You get, you mm -hmm. hear it, and you hear references to it in like several, several songs throughout the game. To listen to it, you'll need an item that can play music, of which I have several, and I do hope you enjoy it, which I will. Oh, big news, huh? Oh. Hey. Is he I don't know about living here, but let's see. Okay, yes. okay, okay. The every okay. Saturday KK concert is want. a go. That's what I want. Does he ever Tradition. live in the village? I don't know. In New Leaf, he must have lived in, in the town because he was there every weeknight doing DJ sets, and he would only go acoustic on Saturdays. Oh, DJ sets. That's awesome. Which is something I am sorely missing in this game, to be honest. I really hope that there's a way to get him to don his DJ KK duds and, like, mix some shit. Because I, I loved the mixes he would play. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's, like, a club version and a retro, uh, like, chiptune version of every song in New, in New Leaf because of that. So, that's awesome. Yeah, I, I, I'm hoping I can see that again. Their <laughs> was once a dessert <laughs> island, but now we can host important concerts. Oh, important. You did it, Ja Rule. <laughs> it was Ja Rule, would, right? Yeah. Okay. Like, yeah. I wouldn't say it was, it was a scam. <laughs> it was maybe false advertising. Thankful <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so to you and everyone else on this island. I guess my getaway package idea is a success. Yeah. My ulterior motive of luring KK out to one of my islands is a success. The, he showed up in other villages for far less effort. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> and these were villages that Tom Nook himself inhabited, too. Yeah. It's like... They have this sense of continuity throughout the series where recurring characters do remember what they did in previous games. So it's weird that Tom Nook, like... <laughs> insists on luring him out to a new island he just wants them all for himself That's yeah i guess so yeah tom nook you know really Pretty is nook. possessive i hope throw hole remains an enjoyable place to live for a long time to come with your help it will don't worry i will make sure of it speaking of which i developed a new app that should help you make the mm. Ooh, a new app a new app for my phone my nook phone nfc that shit to me like Samsung. It's in the middle. <gasps> oh, now you can do stuff. You can move oh, stuff around shit. shit. The island designer? Already? Bold oh, island man, I had the wrong idea. I thought this was still a long ways away from me. Oh, I'm Kermit. <laughs> oh, I may maybe it'll start me off slow. Cause like uh, what I uh, what I thought I understood was that like modifying cliffs and rivers was mm -hmm. um, much later game. Mm -hmm. um, like end game content. Yeah. So if they just start me off with paths, that makes sense to me. But if they give me access to everything, oh no, I need permits. I need permits. <laughs> I, oh man, I, I missed it because I sped it up, but every so often when you, they can isolate Dan, I love the way it sounds. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Tom Nook. Yeah, oh, are you happy? Wow, well now that KK's performed, it's time to focus on making island life better and better. You're right. Haha! <laughs> oh, Aww, what that's... an optimistic way to view the world. That's so f god dang wholesome, man. Like, that actually warms my heart reading it here. It just makes me wish that was real life. 
Uh, it can be if you put on a VR helmet and this and turn on the the give up machine. Yes, you need a, you need this an extensive give up machine. Mm -hmm. What's in the mail right now? Okay, hold on just a sec. <laughs> it's weird your mailbox is telling you. Hey, hold on. <laughs> uh, ooh, I got some Nook mileage. We wish to express our gratitude for continued use of the Nook Stop and the mileage program. The enemy claimed by our redemption services attached this message. Oh, I think I just ordered it. Oh, okay. Um, I got my five ball tee, my one ball tee. I'm trying to collect all the billiard ball tees. And I hear whooshing. There's probably an, a balloon somewhere that I'm missing. There it is. Wait, 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 wait. Ooh, that's so these are like these are no longer packages that you don't want. Yes, now every balloon is a good thing. Good balloon. Well, while I'm waiting for the balloon, I'm gonna see if I can get a hold of this here jewel beetle on the stump. I like you have to sneak. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like there are several um, high high priced bugs and well high priced bugs that will skitter away if you're not mm. careful. Also, did you cut your cheek shaving? Uh, yes, I do have a bandaid on. Yeah. Oh, oh no! Shit. It's way Fuck. over there. Fox now. You can only shoot vertically, eh? Yeah, it only goes up, but it, there's a lot of leniency for like w how deep it is. Or like the angle. You you must be in front of it, but okay. um you can be like a pretty good ways in front of it. Okay. okay. Uh, let me just claim some miles here because I just popped that balloon. Pop balloon. And I think I also had a major thing. Mm. Yeah, I remodeled my house entirely. Oh, you might have noticed when I looked over there. Um, well, I'm a little too far. I'm not gonna. Oh, money tree! Away. Ooh, I, I've been farming them and like once you plant a money tree, you can pick it up. <laughs> I learned without disrupting the money, so you can just arrange them however you like. So I'm trying to just keep a running running grove of money trees. Dang, you're you're literally growing money on trees. Yeah, none of them are, are doing the high payout. Like I'm trying to see if I can um, notice a pattern in when the pet the payout's good. Cause there are days money. there are days when if you uh, bury more than ten thousand bells you will get that amount triple back. But um, the only, the highest amount you're guaranteed is ten thousand per bag, so you might notice that, yeah, there's one black set of roses here. Mm -hmm. That's due to crossbreeding between the reds oh, I'm over here. I'm trying to farm for the black ones. Because eventually, oh. if you crossbreed the black ones and water them with a gold water can, you can get gold roses and they sell for bank. Oh, okay. So it's not for aesthetics. It is all capitalism. Yes, it is very capitalism. <laughs> Wait, what did it say? This is a KK Mania. KK supports the island with his groovy brand of folk rock and every other <laughs> genre, really. So you should support that him. That makes him sound like Beck or something. <laughs> I mean, he's he's done so many different genres. Oh, also, um, new to this this place. Whoa! Here. Here's my museum. Oh, with hookers and blackjack. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they didn't. They didn't want my extra fossils, so I had to find some way to use really? them. Really? How could he not accept it? Well, because he already fucker. had one of each, but, so he's like, still, "You already gave me one. I don't want another one." I'm just like, stack them on top of you. each other. Yeah, like <laughs> it's it's fucker. easy. Fucking let's jabber see if this jaw. Is anything? Let's see if this huge fish is anything other than a sea bass. Sebastian, come on. Sometimes uh, it, it's really finicky to get the right angle. Oh my god. That, it's much oh. like real fishing. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. When it's right on his head, it, he doesn't notice. God. Eat it, you dummy. I mean, this is the this is the folly of having my museum out here. <laughs> I, I, could, I could position better if this stuff wasn't in my way, but shit. Put it in the water. Oh, I have to put the it. Put the fossils in the water. It's hard. There we go. I should do it. No, I, he didn't notice it. Oh, what the fuck? How? This is gonna this is gonna be terrible when it's just a sea bass. Ah! 
Still no. You need to you need to see the fish change direction. Right. Oh. 9 p.m. Oh my god, that was so that was so fast. Sea bass. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. What could it have been? Um something cool and valuable oh, like a blue marlin. I I caught a blue marlin the other day. You could you could make you could make a so like a tuna or something. You could make um a fucking uh, a Stonehenge if you wanted to. Oh, I could. I just need tons of stones of which I do have. Of of to henge. Yeah. It's aptly named that Stonehenge. Ooh, red snappers. Those are worth a pretty penny. I like the puns. Red snapper. Pretty dapper. Yeah, there's a lot of good rhyming going on. For some odd reason, I noticed, or I, oh, my new bridge. It, it's yeah. built. It's, this is new for today, because I only had it built yesterday. The main reason KK came. Yes. It's like, I'm a right now, bridges. right now I have a really horrible hodgepodge of bridges, because I wasn't consistent in the style of bridge I wanted, because they cost different amounts, and depending on how rich I was at the time, Aww. I didn't commit. So I've decided commit, that man. this is my preferred type of bridge, but I have a stone one on one end and then law like really ugly log bridges elsewhere. Show me the log bridge. Hey Bertha. Big oh. Bertha. Oh, Butterbean. Oh. That's what a lot of people call me now. Oh. <laughs> oh Butterbean give me that shell, sure, why not? <laughs> That's a hat. Okay. Give it back. All right, to her. <laughs> and she also gave me express permission to to regift it, which is nice of her to do so. Okay. Yeah. Oh wait, what did I get from the balloon? Ooh, a bamboo Ooh. a bamboo grove wall. Ah, oh, I already know the recipe. That's crazy. Monster oh, right. statue. That, that is what I got from the from the Nook mileage program a monster thing. Uh, well, since I got enough Nook Miles and I had plenty to spend, I figured I should get a protector for my island. <gasps> my god, did you do the thing that we discussed? Um, I forget what we discussed. About having a protector for the island, a big kaiju. Oh, okay. In that case, I think... I think that's right. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's good. That's excellent. Yeah! Oh, yeah, Protect that's fucking us. awesome! That's Protect so fucking us, cool! <laughs> wait, can I- can I make him fi- can I make him fire off? Wait, Hold wait, on. can you shoot fire? <gasps> that's amazing! Oh, it's so cool! <laughs> that is so sweet. Wait, hold on. I need to, I need to see this correctly. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is that's sick. That's so oh. cool. Remember me. <laughs> <laughs> Remember me. <laughs> Oh, I like you have a fugitive games throw pillow on your outdoor patio. Oh yeah, I had so much wood to you know use that I just made a whole bunch of lounge oh, man. chairs. That island is protected. You need to have one on every corner, a different protector for every corner, and it becomes like a legend of the island. Yeah, for like for <laughs> right now, like these guys are kind of doing it. Oh, did you like? I found out that you could do this with certain skulls. If the skull has a really big prominent skull. Mm -hmm. Whoa, what the? You can actually make the move. You can't do this in the museum. That's so weird. Yeah, it's weird. Wow. I'm glad they it's let like you Almost know. every item you can interact in some way, it seems like. Yeah, there's some good ones. Like, there's like a, a skeleton model when if you, um... There's a good skeleton where if you hit A next to it, it does like this... Like, it, it just shoots its arms up. As though it's trying Aww. to scare you. Uh, boo. Yeah, it does like oh. boo sort of a motion. Oh no. <laughs> Thank you for your service. Oh, my fishing rod. And oh, I can't catch anything. House. Oh, that's just for bees. Oh. 
I built the, the bees live thing. in a nice little hut. Um, I don't know if they actually attract bees in the daytime. I hope they do. Mm. So those are the log bridges you're talking about. Yeah. These dinky yeah, little guys. These, these are not as good. These are not as good. Yeah, they, they, they fit more temp. of an island aesthetic if you want to be an island, but I don't think you you want to be something. Yeah, else you want to develop right? a little more. Yeah, it's hard to see from here, but I do have a blue, <coughs> completely blue house now. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, and some cobblestone. I like yeah, I like the Newton's cradle you had out front too. Oh yeah, just on the bench where people are supposed to sit. That's science. Yeah. Science is happening here. I have a nice, like, outdoor cooking line. <coughs> I can cook on the stove and then get a smoked meat and then put it on a pizza and then oh, grill man. the pizza. And while you're looking at the stars. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now the grill looks at the, the grill stars. Needs to see. You harness the power of the stars to, to make the, the grill go. <laughs> oh, it's already too late to visit the Abels, which is too bad because oh. um, I've made progress with them. They talk to me now. They like me there. Yay. You're welcome. How's it going, Eunice? Oh, <coughs> you're happy to see oh, me. Oh, chat. You know, something that's interesting about this game, so, like, people have made memes about this already, but there are a lot of person that, like villager personality types that mm -hmm. kind of uh, make you feel unwelcome or off-put when you talk oh. to them multiple times throughout the day. So oh. there are certain people who, like, you talk to them, like, just the second time within the space of five minutes is like, whoa, someone's chatty today. And, like... They make you feel bad for trying to talk to them. <laughs> jeez, it's like, wow, someone won't shut the fuck up today. <laughs> Basically, yeah, it's like, oh, jeez, you better stop talking to me, you're gonna give me a complex. God. Oh, it's funny that Eunice mentions laundry, because if you go into her house, her entire mm. house is a laundromat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's too bad, she's out, and, she's out and about, so I can't yeah. visit the house, she has to be you inside. Can't just break into their houses with other permission. Yeah. We got Beardo oh, singing. singing there. I, like I don't like the bad. song you're singing, Beardo. I think I can give you a better one to sing. Hold on, hold on, oh. hold on. G g g give me, give me a second. Give me a second. Look at this vinyl collection you have. Let's have you sing KK Metal. Ah shit! Oh, fuck! You went away, fucker. Oh well. <laughs> I do have footage of, of villagers singing cake of singing thrash metal. It's pretty good. That's good. That's good. Oh, also wow. new to my new to my town, I have the Ninja Turtles. Oh. Hi guys. How you doing? They're protecting me. Hi home. Leo. <laughs> Hi Mikey. <laughs> Hi Raph. Hi Donnie. Yeah. I like how they poke their little heads up. Yeah, they also make a tiny little noise. <laughs> that's that's great. the motion. That's the that's the the mouth motion you see in the first movie when they're eating pizza. Oh yeah, right. They should be going pizza, pizza, <laughs> <laughs> and then they make that noise. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's why radical, I thought of it. <laughs> radical, radical, radical. <laughs> anyway, um, I, I I feel like I we've spent enough time here in this evening. Um, there's a lot going on still, Ooh, but... Monkey. Yeah, let's just talk to her. I hate her phrase. Her custom police. phrase is police. Which doesn't always work, which is why I hate it. Mm. What's the latest, Elise? I mean, she's nice and all, but I don't really like her. If she moves out, I won't be sorry. She is a monkey. Yeah, I monkeys. forget if Samson had moved away already. Um, by the oh, Samson's not here. Okay. Yeah, Samson's not here anymore. Um, he moved away. He <coughs> said he wanted to exercise elsewhere. I said, you know what? You do you, buddy. Man. And I so got like I job. heard. So I I had been hearing the way, like the only way to get rid of villagers was to make them feel bad. But I guess you don't have to, and they'll leave. Sometimes anyway. it does happen naturally. Um, sometimes it ha like, I think it's more likely to happen if you make a point to ignore them and not talk to them. Mm -hmm. um, but I don't know. Some of it feels like people just um, seeing connections that aren't there because they want someone gone. They do everything in their power and eventually they leave and they said some of that must have worked. You know? Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. So, like, the tactics of, like, getting on your net and can, can, like, repeatedly hitting people on the head, like, 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 like this. Shit. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, I'll talk to you and be nice. It's true, because she has a lot of apples in it. There you go. Oh, no. I don't oh. do it one time. Oh, no. That would be I, awful to keep hitting someone, and then they go, I don't want to live here anymore. <laughs> well, you can you can hit someone enough times to actually piss them off for a brief period of time. They will say, I don't want to talk to you anymore. But I, which I will not do, because I like my villagers. I think they're cool. Yeah. Except Elise. <laughs> Who's in here? This is Apple. She wasn't done oh. decorating yesterday. But now I see yeah. her whole aesthetic. She has an Apple TV, you know, Dang, from yeah. that company Apple. Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what they look like. <laughs> you, corp you corporate Cheaters. sheep. <laughs> Apple it products, been really Apple funny this, if the Apple that. Thing, it would have been really funny if the whole thing was like plastered in white. <laughs> yeah, and she said genius as her, as her customer. <laughs> Oh, uh, that'd be great. Yeah. <laughs> Low-key picky about my chairs. They have to be apples. <laughs> you know. They, ha they have to be the latest iChair 5. Now, what's this playing on the radio? Yeah, you do have neighbors here. Uh Oh, it's well, weird. She has like a like a, a, a drying rack, but it's next to a stove. <laughs> yeah, and it's above a little mini fridge. That's, that's kind of odd. Steal her food. Ooh, what's inside? I've never looked inside someone else's fridge before. Is it apples? Oh. <laughs> There's an clearly apple. stuff inside. Come yeah, on. Come on. You're just you're just blind. Game, you're just lying to me. Your 3D eyes can't see. <laughs> yeah, that I believe. There was nothing in there. Yeah. What's in the trash can? Oh! Oh shit. It's a functional trash can, okay. Ah, uh, you know what, I can probably get rid of this, because DIY recipes usually don't sell for much, and I can't learn it, so I, I can't offload it. Oh, okay. Oh, oh she's singing. <laughs> <laughs> There's a tiny little apple-shaped creature singing. <laughs> Sneak onto her bed. Okay. Oh. I knew a girl who would like it so mad if I was on her bed. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll leave you to it, Apple. You seem busy. Oh, she's like, goodbye. Oh, okay, she remembered. Nice. How's your museum looking? Uh, pretty. Uh, like I've I've added some stuff since. Mm -hmm. Actually, very excitingly, um, just yesterday they announced um, a lot of stuff that's coming to the game, like updates and DLC, mm -hmm. stuff like museum upgrades. So fine art's gonna become a thing. Oh, I'm gonna have a wing of the museum that's gonna be just for art, art pieces. What a wacky museum! It's got it like is, fossils. Uh, yeah, because it's like part aquarium, part like bug thing and and fossils part and actual then now natural history fine art. yeah let's see um i i've i've noticed that visiting the museum during the days way uh better for bugs because the bugs get yeah, more active yeah it it's all skylights here so when it's bright out you see everything yeah that makes sense that makes sense yeah so it's actually kind of hard to see what i have in this in this environment that's nice. It's nice and moody. Yeah. Like One I of these days, we like got to record during the day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nice. And bugs, uh, bug captures aren't particularly exciting on their own. Um, I would say the most exciting captures I got were fish. Okay. It is really yeah, neat a... sometimes when you notice that there's a villager in the museum. Oh, they, they visit it. Yeah, their time. Oh, that's when, nice. Yeah. That make that, that makes sense too. Like, <laughs> yeah. Thankfully, that you know, you can actually have people come and visit you. How is it so big? 
you know you know animals animal space yeah it's animal space yeah all right what who do we got in the big tank now um i think i had the tuna but now there's a marlin in there too Ooh. and i think the marlin is a little undersized i think a marlin yeah, a should bit. be at least as big as the tuna it's pretty small I mean, for like, marlin in terms of like real life proportions yeah ah, i don't know tuna are really big <laughs> i mean tuna are big but marlins are fucking like gigantic but like you see pictures of people holding marlins Right. I don't think you could actually hold a tuna. <laughs> Another thing I got was an oarfish. Whoa. Whoa. So that long, crazy bastard in in there, like, I just got by dumb luck, but they're the weirdest looking things, man. Oh, the deep sea ones are yeah, the weirdest. Oarfish are weird. Oarfish, boarfish, orpheus, orpheus. <laughs> Worcestershire <laughs> fish. <laughs> uh, the barrel eye, that little guy that has like tubes for eyes and a, like a cockpit window for a head. Um, <laughs> they're they're some of the weirdest damn fish in the world. Like I I got curious to about it and I looked it up and yeah, they're, they're freaking weird. But they're also yeah. very valuable in this game. They sell for fifteen thousand bells, and I caught like three of these. Over the Some of your of my trees play. can give you 10,000 if you play your cards right, right? The trees? Yeah, the money trees. Oh, yeah. E each bag off of a fully grown money tree with the proper investment gives you 30,000 with three 10,000 bags. That's that's the money. Maker. But then if you know which tree will give you like the full payout and not reduce anything, you can get three bags of 99,000 bells if you know what you're doing. <gasps> Dang. But you have to have your you have to have your methodology down. You have to know the pe the pattern perfectly. You gotta have a green the, thumb. You gotta, you gotta know what you're doing. Yes. Yeah. You, you must cultivate it correctly. <laughs> it's Aside just peaceful that, being like, in an aquarium. It is. It is. And unfortunately, once you've already done like one extensive tour of a, of a half full aquarium, it's really hard to keep track of what you had, what you didn't. Yeah, and there's but it's still only nice to, to notice it slowly growing. True, true. If you just compare it to like past footage of me running through. I One do have a you'll... new saw I do have a new turtle there. Oh. But then we already saw turtles out in the open. Yeah, that's that's the turtle that gets to live the high life. The others yeah. have to protect the sewers. <laughs> yeah. Your island sewer network? <laughs> no. It's just a big hole with a bunch of crap. <laughs> then they don't know. <laughs> I mean, there's only one manhole cover. What else do you think is underneath? Man. I mean, I'm, I'm just going through hole? these. <laughs> I'm just hoping to find another villager in here somewhere. Because they usually have like neat comments about the exhibits too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, so some of this stuff has been completed. Whoop. My bad. Not that one. <laughs> but the plesiosaurus, plesiosaurus. is done. Yeah. Archelon, I do not have. But I have a full Ankylosaurus and a Stegosaurus. Oh. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize the Stegosaurus head was so small. Yeah, they are. They're really, really tiny. That's weird. Yeah. Um, I do not have the full Iguanodon yet. I do have a full Parasaurolophus? <laughs> uh huh. Worcestershire sauce. <laughs> Pachycephalosaurus. I got a full one of those. I don't have the rest of the Blue Ranger Zord. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Although Can't that head's pretty yet. iconic. Uh, I don't have all of this. Is it a diet? Oh, it's a Spinosaurus. And what? Not oh, because you have a tail. T yeah, I only have a oh, tail okay. on this T Rex. That's going to be a big guy. Ooh, I found... Yeah, I have what? this now. So they put this blue spot here specifically so that if you stand on it, you can see the full Brachiosaurus. Dang, that's awesome. They thought of everything. Yeah, I didn't have them all built yet the the last time we visited here. And actually, another thing I noticed while by, by standing here, because I haven't done this before, 
you can see the goddamn meteor that's going to kill them all. Oh, no. <laughs> they have to live in terror again. <laughs> uh, it's even gently pulsing a color. Like, it's glowing mm -hmm. a little bit. And if you it's, follow it, it to its natural yeah, conclusion... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Pow! We know for a fact this is how they all died. <laughs> I mean, it was a major ev extinction event. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. They it was made either so much money or, off of it. Yeah. It was either that or they, they got too dependent on fossil fuels. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess everywhere there's, like... I, I'm now noticing this. If there are blue, like, uh, spots on the ground, you can stand there for the camera to do something special. It just, it just, it just lets you see a better angle of the place in general. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. So I should be on the lookout for more of those. Like, there's a blue one right in there in front of the that exhibit, so it moves mm. it closer. You got the blue spot here to see your brachiosaurus, and I guess that's it for this room. So yeah, that that that's uh, that's interesting stuff. That's animals. Very animals. I have seen a screenshot of someone else who, uh, you know that, like, uh, hall of silhouettes for all the different animals that, like, are the end points of evolution? Yeah, yeah. Um, I've seen a screen cap, and they indeed will stand in the sh in the silhouette, like, okay, perfectly okay. if a villager happens to be in that room. Okay, good, good. That's so there's, want. like, a koala that was, like, standing perfectly inside the koala spot. Perfect. It's like, yeah, good, good. So I don't know where the art of the art museum is going to end up, but ooh, leaves are falling outside. I imagine it would open up here. Yeah, probably somewhere in this area. New and uh, the new fine art wing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because right now that's just a mezzanine to nowhere. Yeah, so. true. And so um, I will be excited to show off how that art is acquired. Because um, there's going to be this shady ass fox who comes to sell you art. But he has, <laughs> he has like, well, the way it worked in New Leaf was that he would have four pieces of art in his in his tent when he, sh when he showed up. He'd mm -hmm. say, I got fine art for sale. Pick anything you want. And you can only buy one thing. But three of the four pieces of art would be fake. <laughs> but every single piece of art is based on a real actual piece of like historical art so if you really wanted to you could you know hand research every piece and make sure that what you were getting was exactly the same oh as what you God. see so so like it'll be like one detail off or something exactly it, it was it was that bad like um remember do you know that painting of the girl with the pearl earring yeah yeah um the the one that was fake had a bad had a white earring instead of a blue earring <laughs> you had to know that shit. Are they all of the same painting? Uh, no. So like be every four piece different of paintings, four okay, different so. pieces of art, one of oh, which God. is actual, and the, all the rest three have one minor detail that's what wrong. A bastard. Yeah. So because um, like even if that's real, that's still illegal. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so they made him even shadier in this game inside the trailer of the announcement of, of the mechanic he like shows uh -huh. up in this rickety ass boat on the back of the island <laughs> and then you go inside the boat and it's like dark in there <laughs> like you're like looking at art with a flashlight <laughs> and he has guards holding machetes <laughs> yeah <laughs> And that's something I also noticed while looking at the trailer is that um, the fox, his name is Red, but he mm -hmm. uh, wears like a blue apron, like a traditional like like store store owner apron, like a Japanese style store owner apron. Mm -hmm. um, and it looks very reminiscent of how Tom Nook used to look in the first game. So I was wondering if they intended for like, hey, sure, Tom Nook might be a tanuki and somewhat mischievous and intrude. But look at this fucking fox. <laughs> look at this Please fucker who, wa who, who wants nothing more than to deceive you and trick you out of your money, like, entirely. Because you, you pay a lot for that art. Like, Why give you real art at all? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Maybe he doesn't know the difference. Maybe he's convinced everything he's selling is counterfeit and every so often there's a gem. Well, is he, like, happy when he sells you something <laughs> shitty? 
I've never bothered to check and make sure. Well, like, the, I guess, I guess basically, I'm assuming you bring it to Blathers, and Blathers goes, Yeah, oh, yeah, I'm you can sorry. assess, yeah, like, any piece of art you have him assess, he's like, oh, sorry, dude, this isn't real. Yeah, you got and, fucked. And then <laughs> it sells for, it sells, like, not much yeah. at all, and I think you can he still goes, gift it to someone, but, you know, yeah. who, wants, who wants fake art, man? I want fake art. Well, then, that makes Give one of us. Me. Yeah. Talk, like blathers will see the see the art and go oh my word you've been fucked <laughs> <laughs> i'm sorry sir but you've been well and truly fucked <laughs> Ooh, now there. this is clay's house but i feel bad because he was one of my starter villagers so i don't get to see what his actual setup would be because i've learned that um your starter villagers don't get to change. Don't get to have their fully realized homes. Oh, that sucks. They have to stay with the sh shitty starter pack. Yeah, they start with like shitty starter pack furniture that is specific to their personality type, but not specific to their character. Oh. So you don't like the later villagers get to do like full character houses because like that's when your own house capabilities will have like. Mm -hmm. expanded enough to decorate well but at the beginning they want you they want you to not feel so bad he's living and on a dirt floor <laughs> like yeah it's pretty bad <laughs> hey clay what's up you gotta wreck up the place so that he's forced to redecorate yeah clay is uh considered a lazy type hamster oh, i like that <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good <laughs> i like <laughs> That's good. I like that. Later, Clay. I like you. Clayface McGee. I mean, ideally you want like an assortment of villagers that have like a decent variety. I have admittedly a few personality doubles. And you really do notice when you have multiple like multiple villagers that share personalities because they have similar dialogue. That's okay. It's so okay. when They're you get repeating unique. dialogue, it's like, ah, that sucks. The, the, the seams. You see the Ooh. seams. Oh, I can craft myself a rocket. Let's see if I can... No, I don't have... Also, how's Isabel doing? She's still working hard? Oh, yeah. She's doing good. Ooh, you got yourself a Waldo shirt. Oh, wait, no. The shirts just look like that. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. I can wear the one ball, sh one ball tee. Haha, <laughs> you're a one ball. Oh, got there she is doing again. her yoga. Bertha likes to do yoga. That's good. Gotta stretch. When you're big and birthing, you have to you have to stretch it out. Oh man, they're both busy. Oh. oh if music. you if you get them early enough in the morning, they're both doing exercises. It's pretty good. <laughs> their morning stretches. Yeah, I have a clip. I have a clip of that I saved onto the switch. Oh, I never realized they have like uh they have a face to face desks. Yeah, <laughs> <and> work buddies. <laughs> yeah, they they like depending on like every time you come in here, they're doing something different. Um, Isabel might be dusting the place, making coffee like she is now, or she might be spraying and sniffing this flower, or just looking out the window when there's like an event going on. Uh huh. Well, she's like, I wish I could be there. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. She never gets out. She still never gets out, and it bothers me. She's such a workaholic. Yeah, I don't like it. You have to woo her out with gifts. That's how it works. Uh, you have to court Isabel. <laughs> the Isabel court arc begins. <laughs> okay, I already have that Goddard and Fawcett. Ooh, I can order a magazine. Sure, why not? Just throw it on the ground outside oh, your house. Oh, a do wreck. <laughs> oh, dang. <laughs> oh, the thing you should be careful about giving to people. <laughs> <laughs> there. I mean, I, I I sent this to Marvin, but there's yeah. this amazing picture of like a, a player who has like a black avatar, and one yeah. of the villagers says, "Here, I heard you love these. It's a durag." Yeah, it's not great. <laughs> but the caption that came along with it, or the person who posted, it, was like, "Well, they're not wrong, but I still feel <laughs> weird." <laughs> And oh yeah, god, you might as well have given him some fried chicken at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. god. 
Ugh. Ooh, KK Folk. Yeah, I don't have that guy. This is this seems to be the primary way to expand your music collection, which I'm not super huge on. I kind of wish what there was, was a better way. Um, you could find it inside the stores. Mm, not okay. not like through a terminal. You would like actually see the album, you know? Okay, and you would and see the like, album like, before you saw the title. Yeah, it'd be like prizely like positioned and you'd be like, ooh, that looks good. Yeah, yeah. It was it was a little, a little more like that. And even even now, I don't really love how albums are like in picture frames. Mm. I kind of like that. It's it's cool, but it it, it gives I don't know. It, it makes me it makes me feel like less of a music item to me. Mm. I guess that's true. That that bandage looks like a pair of glasses. <laughs> and that's what I'm already wearing right now. Yeah. Uh, I don't have a number two shirt. I should get that. You want all the numbers, eh? Yeah, anything that's like sequential or easy to collect like that, I like to just get them. Special good. And this is a handy way to keep track of all the stuff you already have obtained before. Mm. This is like literally everything, including stuff history. that can't be bought. Yeah. Yeah, so. There's, there's a lot. I'm back. We'll leave a lot on board. I don't have anything that I need to buy from the Nook Miles program right now. Hey, Isabel, I want to talk to you. Oh, she noticed. <laughs> Look at her run. Yeah, I like how every time she moves, the little bell on her head mo like makes a sound. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's a collar on her head. Like on the yes. top of her head. Huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you'll notice, it looks kind of like an upside down bag of bells. Mmm. Yeah. So yeah. she is a bell. Anyway, let's let's see what people think of our island right now. Yes. How the image. Three star rating. Cool. Okay. She does impressions. <laughs> oh, that's great. Artist Collective. Oh, um, this must be Flick, the chameleon who, who left this note here. He's, oh, okay. he's, a, he's an artist. Okay. You can sell bugs to him for 150% profit. Nice. Uh, compared to the last report, more folks responded positively to our island scenery. Nice. That. Um, I think it's furniture out in the open on the island, but you get extra points for furniture that is supposed to be outside. Okay, so there's, there is, it's not just throw a bunch of items outside and they'll be like, that's great. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, you do <laughs> need to have some sort of sense to it and you can get cluttery. I gotcha. I think she'll still give me a note about clutter because I have a bunch of clutter on the island. Oh, that it. Yeah. I Which, know, Isabel. It, I know, but but it's but it's for your it's for your crafting purposes. Well, not just that. I I do leave random things around. Like back <laughs> when I was first de-weeding the entire island, I would leave clumps of twenty at a time because there was a Nook Miles achievement for selling twenty, like, twenty weeds. Uh. But if you sold more than that, you would waste the weeds to sell mm -hmm. for those miles. And I was like, I'll just keep them all lined up and. And then eventually I learned that they don't give you that achievement to do if there aren't any weeds to pick, so I just sold them all. <laughs> You're good for now. Cool. Tom, I want <laughs> you gotta to talk hop to you over to a, a different chair. Oh, sounds like the inside of a can. Yes. Oh, I can do a ceremony for the bridge. Oh. We've already seen that though. That's cool though. Um, about my home. I can't expand because I'm still paying off that loan. It's oh, currently over a million bells. I need to pay him back over a million bells for my second story. Oh jeez. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty pricey. You're deep in the hole. 
I've never relocated before, but I don't intend to do that until I can really, like, terraform the damn place. And set up, like, a central palace area. Yeah, like a brain palace. Um... What should I do? Now that KK's here, what, what are you gonna say? You've defeated Tom Nook. <laughs> oh, he goes back to saying this, because he used to say this before the resident services thing was built. Mm -hmm. And so it was like, it was like, I guess he says that when the game doesn't want to have you do anything specific. But it's interesting that they do give you these times where he won't give you anything specific to do, even though there's clearly other things you can do to progress the game. Hmm. Because, um, like, there are other clear things that haven't happened yet, like, you can upgrade Nook's Cranny, it can turn into a better looking store. And, um, other things like that, so... I don't know. Okay, so you can upgrade their stores for them. Uh, you can't... No, you, once you satisfy a certain list of prerequisites, they will upgrade it on the following day. Oh, okay, so you inspire them. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> we, got a, we got a little fucker here. He's a little fucker go here. Go find that monkey lady and hit her. No, I'm not. I don't want to <laughs> hit her. I'm hoping she just realizes that people don't like her and then hit her with a net. Make her angry. Oh, that was barely. That wow. was barely. Tarandula. Huh. I'm not about to let that shit go. Oh, there she is. To hit her. Throw it at her. <laughs> <laughs> I will swap it for this Bamboo Grove wall DIY, which is useless to me. I'll just leave that there like a Yu-Gi-Oh card. <laughs> Some In defense mode. Yeah. <laughs> Hit her! <laughs> oh, they're asking me a question. What's the most important thing you take into consideration when you're picking out new clothes? Reuse comfort. comfort. Yeah, it's always comfort. That sounds about right. <laughs> I mean, she, everything she has to say is nice. Like, you, you never have anything. You haven't never had any problems with like how she behaves. Just that, still, I just don't like monkeys. You know, <laughs> it's really racist of me. I should stop. <laughs> Pull out your axe, like you did in that one bunny video. <laughs> This ends now. <laughs> actually, I, I noticed I noticed something that's actually kind of fun. Like once you set your camera, uh -huh. you can just fuck off. You can just, oh, okay. This is this is how you did it. This is how you did that video. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey, at least. Fancy meeting you here out in this night. <laughs> the only thing is that during camera mode, you can't um, hit A or anything to yeah, yeah. swing your axe or nothing. You can only um, threaten. Yeah. You can't. Yeah. Oh, I. But with this camera trick, you can pull off a little something. Um. I actually wondered if it could be utilized for like a video. Um. Somewhere. Well. Oh. But if you say you do this. And you, then you run off. Oh, it's got a thing. Yeah, like once you get far enough, sufficiently far away, it tries to like root you around and tell you where you're, where you're going and all that other stuff. Uh, all right, I think I've done it sufficiently. So once you dismiss the camera, it scrambles to, to catch up with you. Uh huh. And to me, it it seemed very much like an anime opening. Oh dang. So, just imagine some Asian Kung Fu generation as this happens! Whoa. I just wish it could go on for longer. Anyway, steady, how, how, how you playing. doing? Oh god, I didn't, I didn't mean it got oh, to one, no. sorry. You dinged your new statue! Remember me! I love that it sounds like a Pokemon. I know, I was gonna it say. Sounds like it sounds if Godzilla like a was a Pokemon, and that's amazing. Yeah, that's great. 
In fact, it might be like loosely based on one of the poker cries. On a Charizard. What, does a, what does a Charizard sound like? I don't know. I think it sounds similar to that, actually. Maybe it is. Maybe they did it on purpose. Yeah. Charizard. Yeah. Alright, my pockets are too full. I, I get really anxious when I can't pick anything new up. <laughs> pockets are too full of sand. Ah! What Whoa. is it, Beardo? Oh, I'm gonna learn a new reaction. Cool, a new, like, expression. Oh. Grease up those teeth? <laughs> Grease up the... <laughs> uh. Oh, the smirk, the, the Emma Watson look. Alright, let, let's see how this looks. I learned the smirking reaction. Ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah, I guess so. It's a little harder to see when I have my glasses on. No, which I cannot take glasses. off. The third dimension. Judge <laughs> 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 <Charge> you. <laughs> uh, everyone looking at Don Hertzfeld. Oh, I, I, God, I, I hope everyone already knows. <laughs> no, I think we're already a generation removed from, like, back oh. in the day, Rejected was well-known by the internet, and now it's not, I don't think. That's People don't possible. know what Rejected yeah. is they, these days, I don't think. Um, alright, let's unload some shit. I need to get rid of these guys, all y'all, and I'm not about to build that shit anymore, because the Nook Mile thing went away. And... I don't... Want an eggshell hat? I'm sorry. Yeah, I mean, I, is, it, is it the eggshell hat based on 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 Easter? Um, it looks a lot like one. Okay. And, you know, I just think like a whole dumb like big comical eggshell hat that's all broken on the top. Twenty one thousand. Oh. That's pretty. That's a good amount for what I bought or what I'm selling. He's thank got you, turpentine for sale. It looks like turpentine. <laughs> You're interested can. in a metal can. Full <laughs> of turpentine. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, ooh. Electronics. Oh, it's got a soldering iron and everything. Yeah, a soldering iron, like uh, a voltmeter. Yeah. A PCB. Some Hell pliers. Yeah. You can make some. You can make some. Some Google. Some some pie pie controller shit there. Yeah. Raspberry Raspberries. Pie shit. Yeah. Oh, that I didn't realize these are for stale. <laughs> that reminds me of that. I, I think it was a hard hard times article where it's like, why would I want to? Oh God, I'm gonna butcher it. It had to do with the the Super Nintendo Classic. Uh huh. And. And how everyone loves to... You need to look it up for me, Marvin. I'm, I'm, you have I'm to doing it. I'm doing you have to save Why it. spend $80 on an SNES Classic when you can install emulators in a Raspberry Pi and never shut the fuck up about it? Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know what's funny? The channel... One of the channels I follow, Linus Tech Tips, he's totally uh -huh. does something like this. <laughs> 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 to be fair, he did a really, really awesome thing where he, he actually created his own arcade machine. <laughs> okay. Well, you know, yeah, I mean, and also he does it, like, for a video on a channel and all that other yeah, stuff. Yeah, Like, whatever. Yeah. Like, it turns into... And then the arcade machine goes in the employee lounge, and now it's an employee lounge machine. It's cool. Yeah, sure. There's, yeah. there's more reason for him to do it than other people. <laughs> And he does shut the fuck up about it. <laughs> yeah, eventually he had to. Yeah. For sponsors. Hey, what the heck did you just do, Eunice? Did you just toss something in the river? What? Is she, is she getting rid of evidence? <laughs> What's in her hand? It's bones. <laughs> oh, it's a, it's a dumbbell. Oh. You're exercising. Oh, lamb chop's fun. Yeah, I like, I like hey, lamb chop. She's not as good as the burger sheep, though. Yeah. The burger sheep has a little more personality, but Eunice is nice because she's, she's normal. Yeah. She's a normal nice, type. Nice, normal, tasty sheep. Oh, God. 
I don't want to activate this trap card. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, let's I visit Dell. Because he's got a cool house. It looks like a, it looks like a battleship. Because in Japan, his name was Yamato. Yamato. Because he, like he looks like battleship Yamato. Oh dang! Yeah, I gave Look him all the gears moving, and he's got like a Tesla coil, and, and like a kitchen, like an industrial kitchen sink, and a and a and, a, and the what's it, a generator? Why is a generator <laughs> indoors? It's weird. I don't know. It's just generally oil drums. Just in the general stuff. Dang. He's playing Battleship. I think that I think that electric that weird plasma ball thing is something I gave to him. Oh, okay. I think that's what used to be sitting outside my house. Oh yeah, I was wondering where it went. Okay. okay. Yeah. I replaced it with another desk toy. There was too much science happening. You yeah. had to get rid of some science. Yeah. I, th I think he looks pretty snazzy in that vest, though. Usually he has a striped shirt on, but I gifted him that vest on purpose so he would wear it. Oh, nice. I like so. how they will always wear it. Uh, they'll, they'll swap out. They'll swap out. They, oh, they'll, okay. they'll swap between their default, like their workout clothes, anything that you gifted them. Um, they're considerate, and they live their lives. What a considerate folk. Yeah, this is, you know, nice, it's a nice game full of nice aminals. Can you pole vault up a cliff? Unfortunately not. That will look oh, okay. cool, but yeah. they won't let you. It's only ladders, okay. Yeah, so over time I'm, I'm gonna need to keep outfitting the, my cliffs and things with more bridges and more inclines or ramps that I can use to travel up okay. and down. It's death this, stranding. This was money. Yeah, th that th it basically it is. Honestly, <laughs> like the the fact that so much progression in this game is based around making it easier to to traverse land. And you are the source of it all. Yeah, exactly. And you, and you kind of bring and... bring like items to everyone. Like Animal Crossing is absolutely hundred percent a strand game. Hideo Kojima just wanted to make like like a like a, a, a an Animal Crossing game with his friends. That's all he wanted to do. Yeah, <laughs> like he. I think some people peg Death Stranding as like his Breath of the Wild, but it's more like an Animal Crossing. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, because like the end game is really just building bridges constantly, like, or like roads. Oh my which god, are Apple! Basically what are you bridges. doing back here? Oh my god, it looks so sinister. Oh, okay. Check your cheekers. You're just like looking into his back window. A creeper. Creeping and peeping. Dude, I don't I don't know if I like that. Hit her. <laughs> <laughs> actually, it's kind of blowing my mind that uh, Apple is actually a girl, because I think I first met her in Pocket Camp and they didn't specify what she was, so I just assumed it was like a cute little like male hamster like chubby boy yeah like a little chubby boy hamster but oh, oh, it's... oh he's getting ready to strike you nah he's fine he's fine oh get fucked scorpo nah oh, it's a citrus a longhorn beetle oh. or beetle orange you happy oh i mistook it's it's horn for the tail of a, of a scorpion there are scorpions in this game make no mistake but i think the easiest way to encounter them is to go to an island oh they're talking they're talking they're talking <gasps> They're having conversations with each other. Bertha, how could you? Hmm. What, oh. what would Bertha say? So normal. Oh, don't, don't act like that, Bertha. <laughs> I like oh, this is pretty going. good. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> oh, no. oh, see, at least he's being nice and supportive. Still got to hit her, though. <laughs> You're really nice, that looks Elise. so mean. It just looks really bad. It honestly does. It looks so. Can you do that with an axe? No, I don't think okay, so. Okay, okay. 
Yeah, I don't oh, think you can God. actually get to get to actually hitting anyone with it. Okay, because that's a kill. That's a murder. Oh God! <laughs> that's so close. Oh! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> They're in. Oh shit! I'm playing. I'm playing with fire. They're gonna Damn. end me. <laughs> They have an AT field. Oh shit. Oh, she's singing KK Metal. Yeah. Oh, check out the solo. Yeah. Yeah. Go, Bertha, go. Yeah. It's metal as shit. You're holding an axe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, and then she said hi to somebody. <laughs> All right. I that think that rad. does it for this update, guys. I think we've looked around and seen enough stuff. I mean, like I said, there are major updates coming, so this isn't even the last you've seen of Animal Crossing. There's still more stuff forthcoming, and probably at least one session in the day where you can see more things. Because you can actually see a lot more in the day. <laughs> I must yeah, we admit should, that. Yeah, we should plan for that. Yeah, we should plan. Yeah, for let's it. actually record in the middle of the day someday. Yeah. All right, everybody. We'll see you later. I will try to say goodbye using one of my thingies here. Okay. Uh, do it. Do it. Why are they all... Cold chill. <laughs> I guess it's greetings. Yes. No, I think it's joy. It's joy where I do the this thing. No, that's not it. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Marvin, you need to just cut to the right one when I find it. No, this is all staying in. Just cut to the right one. No, it's just all in. Just, just cut to the right one. I guess this has to work. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. <laughs>